Well, a new documentary filed in, filmed in Hardin seeks to raise awareness about Montana's missing and murdered indigenous persons cases. Q2's Russ Riesinger talked to the host of that film to find out more. Juliet Hayes is a member of the Cushata tribe of Louisiana, which has taken an active role in trying to address the MMIW crisis. She admits she was shocked at how many people have gone missing in Bighorn County in recent years. I'm here to find out why this county, with fewer than 14,000 residents and this small reservation border town Hardin, has been called the epicenter of the MMIWG tragedy. As an indigenous woman myself, my heart just completely broke for all of these families. I couldn't imagine what they were going through, and it was just, it's absolutely gut-wrenching. Say Your Name focuses on the cases of Kaysera Stops Pretty Places, Selena Not Afraid, and Henny Scott, three young Native American women who went missing and were later found dead. The cause of death for Not Afraid and Scott was determined to be hypothermia, while no cause of death was found for Stops Pretty Places, whose body was discovered in broad daylight near a busy road in Hardin, five days after she was reported missing. Uh, I know she's placed here and there's foul play because she didn't just die from a drug overdose or, or a seizure or anything. There was no help to them. These families, they have to do investigations on their own. They have to go out and find answers. They have to figure out and put pieces to the puzzle together and figure out what happened to their daughters. Why are they missing or why have they been murdered? All three of the families questioned what really happened to their daughters. Hayes believes there would have been more urgency with the investigations if the women had been white. They kept telling me that maybe she's with a friend, maybe she's got a new boyfriend. Did you try checking there? <laughs> it's like they didn't even want to help me. <laughs> the courage and strength that it took to relive the details of the worst time in their lives, they did with such grace. And they did because they don't want this to happen to anyone else. Hayes hopes the 30 minute film will shed light on the MMIWG crisis and inspire federal legislation so that more will be done to find those who go missing and get to the roots of the problem. Because national media, uh, they, it is, they don't really cover it. You know, it's not really something that you hear about. It makes these families feel, and it makes Native Americans and Indigenous people as a whole feel like we're, we don't matter. Why is it that our lives, you know, can just, um, we could just be killed so senselessly and nothing happens. There's no consequences. Say Your Name is available to watch for free on YouTube. I've put a link to it in this story on our website, ktvq.com. I'm Russ Riesinger reporting for MTN News.